Hi guys, in today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to get mods in Gorilla Tag, just like I have right here, and you have, you know, mod a mod menu, you can get any type of mod, it doesn't have to be a mod menu, but yeah, I'll show you how, it's pretty easy, all you need is Steam, a computer that can run it, and a link cable, or air link, if you want, if you have good Wi-Fi, and yeah, that's basically all you need, so let's get into the video. Okay, so the first thing you want to do is go to your, so there's actually two things you can do to download this. The easy way first is to open Steam, click the settings thing, click manage, click browse local files, open your files, click back the next, plugins, and then you're here. And Or the other way is you go to your browser, search monkey mod manager, and click the deadly kitten github page. It's going to be right here. And then you scroll down until you see monkeymodmanager.exe. It's not a virus. Click open. And for you, it might say, could not locate girl tag file. Please locate it. Just like find the file. But yeah, for me, it's here. And click weapon inject, computer interface, and all of these down here. Except banana hook. It messes with your game a bit, so don't download it. And then these are optional over here. All of these uh, mods you can use if you want, but you don't need to. And then just click install slash update. And then click utilities. And then click Bepinex folder. Click plugins. And then you're here. Now you could do this with Steam, but you want to get like the little like mod menu thing here. But you don't really need this. But yeah. Now say you want a mod menu. For, so if you want a mod menu, go on the web and search the uh, girl. Oh wait, Gorilla Tag Mod Menu Word, of course. Okay, here we are. We have a bunch of mod menus. Let's see. Let's get Nico Leaked Menu. And on free menu. We're going to download this. So just download the menu a lot. Click. It's not a virus, though. It just alters the game code, so it thinks it's a virus. Click Keep Anyway. Now, what you want to do is, if you use Monkey Mod Manager or Steam, it doesn't matter. Still open the Plugins folder and drag in the mod menu to the plugins folder just like that so now we have the mod menu in there now i'm not and you can do this again for the monkey mod manager but if you do on the monkey mod manager what you need to do is drag it into the folder it's it's not letting me and then you click install slash update once you've dragged it in the folder and you can exit out and for steam all you have to do is drag it in the folder then exit out and then it's done so now what you can do is go over to steam click play as you can see we're in the game and uh oops wait my battery is gone hold on i'll be back okay, uh yeah we're back now okay so basically uh if we click here uh we have two mod menus in one but it worked but hold on i'm, I'm gonna go disable one of the mod menus i'm gonna disable my old one so you can actually see this one so hold on so oh, as you can see, you don't have to get this exact mod menu. You can get really any mod menu or any mod that you want. Drag it into your uh, Girl Attack folder, plugins folder, and you have it in game. But for me, this is a mod menu I got, and uh, you just click the the button on your controller, click one of them, it'll pop up. Now this one is different than others. It doesn't have a lot of features, but yeah, as you can see, it has platforms. You know, just normal platforms. Yeah uh and it's literally that's it there's like nothing else on here but yeah you know that's how you get any mod that you want you can get mod menus you can get uh a computer interface which i'll show you right now that is the computer interface mod which you can basically you can manage your mods as you can see it has extra buttons you can even uh if you go here and you can go to color and you have custom 255 colors also. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to like and subscribe for more Gorilla Tag tutorials. And make sure don't mod in public lobbies, just mod in private lobbies with your friends if they give you permission. Or mod in, in uh, modded lobbies. But don't grief other players, that's bad. And yeah, just uh, hopefully you enjoyed and that helped. And if you need any help or if you need like an updated version, I will make an updated version because just tell me if you need a new version and I'll make it. And yeah, that's it. Bye.